Hello, welcome back to The Grow Zone. My name's Ian. Uh, in today's video, we're gonna look back at an experiment we did um, with our pepper plant that we grew in our DWC system. These are cuttings from the main plant that we then added into our Harvey 6 here from Nelson Garden, which is a Kratky style hydroponic system. Super easy to use. Um, we didn't know if the cuttings that we took were going to do anything. Uh, they've been here for, as I said, two months now. Um, and they are looking very healthy. It's time to think about adding some artificial light to these plants. The daylight hours are getting smaller and smaller here in southern Sweden. Um, the mornings are especially very dark. We have uh, LED number one from Nelson Garden that I'm going to add here today just to give this guys um, a little boost. I'm also going to top up the nutrients. I'll get you, give you a look inside and you can see how much it's drunk. Um, if you want to see the original video where we added these in or selected them from the plant, uh, check it out here. I'll leave a card and that's the thumbnail image so you can recognize it. <laughs> Lift this off the Harvey 6, nice and easy to do. Grab either end. I'll go past you there. And get a good look at those roots. Like I said, that one in the center there, he's got some nice lead roots, but hasn't produced anywhere near as many as the other five plants, um, which are obviously quite happy drinking up the tripod. We've got our nutrients. I've just got a, an old mineral water bottle here. So it's 1.5 liters, I believe. Uh, and I've got it filled with Terra Aquatica from Tripart. This is actually pre-mixed in a, a flexi tank that we have out in the grow room. If you want to see videos of our RDWC setup, which is very, um, which is growing tomatoes right now, check that out. We recently did a refill. Uh, but for the sake of this video, I want to keep this as simple as possible and therefore as accessible as possible. If you want to get more advanced, go back and check out our other playlist. We've got DWC videos. RDWC and bits and pieces with the Harvey here. This is for simple indoor growing. I'm going to fill this back up and we'll keep these rather happy looking pepper plants going for a little while. Okay, so I've just added that a bottle of pre mixed nutrients. And if it will kindly focus, we can just see that it's just touching the bottom of the line that says grow above it and that is exactly where we want our water level okay so i have our led number one from nelson garden um, these are a 60 centimeter led panel and they have a 6400 kelvin uh, light output which is a white light um, pepper plants uh, would prefer to have a full spectrum or close to, but um, these are in the window. And like I said in the beginning of the video, this is just to supplement their light in the mornings and on the ends of the days and, and the bookends. Um, I was gonna put them up with the window hanger with the suction cups, um, but instead I'm gonna, tr I'm gonna try these ratchets out. These are a new arrival for us onto the shop, growzone.se. Um, and uh, yeah, it should, it should be a pretty simple solution. And I'm going to aim for about 30 centimeters ish of height. I'm just going to use these ratchets, clip around the body of the LED. Enough of it. Um, and have it sitting around there somewhere. 
There's our illuminated pepper plants in the Harvey Six with tripart from Terra Aquatica experiment growing very nicely. The light is on a timer from Nidis, smart timer. I'll adjust those hours in the app a, a bit later, just to bookend the day with a bit of extra light to keep these guys going. Experimental hanging techniques, <laughs> not the most level thing I've ever seen in the world, but it will do the job and it's height adjustable as well. So nice and handy. Please do check out our other videos. Um, the first video of this, when we chose our cuttings, lots of playlists as well, such as this one, DWC, where we grew this pepper plant from seed to harvest. And yeah, check out the website, growzone.se. See you in the next one. Okay, bye.